Well, guys, um, we've just lost one of, one of our friends. Uh, this the yesterday, in fact, he died yesterday, and he looked very, very uh, fit and healthy. But he lost his battle yesterday. He was diagnosed with colon cancer, cancer of the colon, in April, and he passed away yesterday. So that just told me that, you know, um, life is too short. And I want to say this to you that better that you invest your time, your precious time invested on people who truly care for you. People who truly, you know, we have the tendency of wisely to please people that don't really even give back anything, who are just sucking out of you constantly sucking and not willing to give back anything so this is my advice to you that use this as your yardstick to check who are these people it is people that you would want to have when you are sleeping on your deathbed before you take your last breath who would you want to be with alongside your bed? Who would you want to be alongside your bed, bed and last people to see before you depart this world? That is what you need to do. And these are the people that you need to invest much time to on than wasting your time in pleasing people who won't actually mean anything when you're about to take your last breath. breath. So, but I'm, I'm going to be fine. I'm going to be back and do my live broadcast at 8 in the morning where we worship, truly worship in truth and in spirit. Uh, but just now, I think God has just um, given me a break. Uh, he is resting me so that I can gather energy. I've been doing this since day one of the lockdown. And yeah, I think my body just got tired and I needed this break uh, but I'm gonna be fine and I do miss you and you know I care and I love you guys sup